Hello, everyone. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, hello, hello. Look, look, I just got rained on. All right, I'm seeing Lewis, I'm seeing Ant, I'm seeing Stephen. Who else we got on? I see more than 10. I only three see three names right now. Ah, it's pouring down here. We have a tropical storm coming through. It's going to get worse tomorrow. It's pretty rough right now. Adriano's here, Richard Johnston's here. Mike Franks, how are you, sir? Come on, find the Discord, it's just down here. Okay, I'll do that for you. There it is. All right, I hope everyone's had a good week. How many people caught the Wednesday Live with Michael Jackson? I think it was 14 Michael Jackson songs that I played. I've got my beer. Yeah, we've had an election. <laughs> Okay, that's my headphones. Auntie Mavis, you're here. Let me, let me get something. So everyone's coming in, everyone's joining the chat, and um, we've got how many people? 21 people on here so far. That's all right. If you can only catch half of it, you can catch the other half tomorrow. Um, I just put all the, um, I know I was a little bit um, busy in the week, so I just put all the timestamps on from last week's live and also the one from Wednesday. But I've got some sheet music that I'm working on right now, and I've, uh, I've been actually getting these uploaded to music notes. So uh, I'm going to read a few of them through. Um, Santa Claus is coming to town. Believe, which is from the Polar Express, When a Child is Born. We've got Sleigh Ride. Um, I just uh, approved Begin the Begin today, which is unbelievable. It's 10 pages long. It's going to be the same price, nine ninety nine. Annie's Song is coming out as well. And we've got Rule the World by Take That. We've got Greatest Day by Take That. Morning is Broken is coming, coming out. Um, Versace on the Floor. And of course, that new uh, Coldplay song that I did last week was uh, Sky Full of Stars. So that's all coming out on Music Notes in November. Yeah, good stuff. I haven't decided what I'm going to order next, but uh, that'll take the tally up to about 135 sheets that are up on Music Notes. And uh, if you want to see all of them, go up to my um, website, which is neilarcher.net, and you'll be able to see all of the stuff that's coming. So I wanted to share that with you. Hello by Lionel Richie. Okay, uh, we can do that. Oh, yeah. I'll tell you what, let's do a little sound check because... Um, <laughs> hopefully it's okay and it's not distorting anything because I don't want it to. Let me um, put this down here. like so. 
And let's play a song. And um, you can tell me whether it sounds good. tense in that. Look at that. Look at that. Ah. Great, right? Let's bring the keyboard in and do this song. Again, tell me if it distorts. I don't want it to.
Well, that woke everybody up. It's a good one to start with and uh, test the audio. No distortion, right? Tell me, please, it's not distorting, because if it is, I'm going to turn things down a little bit, because that was pretty heavy. So if it's not distorting, it's a good sign. It's a good start. And I see that the tips have started already. Something from uh, Michael Bolton. Which is going to come. Sorry if I'm a long sleeve shirt. Yeah, look at that. I know. Made us the <laughs> I've been po wearing polo shirts for the whole thing, you know. So I thought I'd uh, change it up a little bit. And um, all right, hopefully everything's sounding good. your lips a thousand times I sometimes see you pass outside my door all together hello is it me you're looking for I can see it in your eyes I can see it in your smile you're all Cause you know just what to say And you know just what to do And I want to tell you so much I love you I saw that one come up on the request, so there it was. Little Lionel Richie, hello. All right, let's do that one um, by 
Michael Bolton. Hey, look at all the applause. Look at that. Love it. Thank you so much. I've got to find it because I'm going to do this one with the keyboard. It's got a great track list. I think uh, this one needs to, the electric piano probably needs to be turned down a little bit on this one. But um, I'm going to find it first, so bear with me. Oh, I hate it when I can't find it. Oh, here it is. How am I supposed to live without you, Michael Bolton? Here we go. <laughs> hang on a minute, hang on a minute. I counted myself in too early then.
Wow, what a song. What a great, great song. Hope you enjoyed that. I've got just got another tip here. Oh, Arthur's theme. Okay, yeah, we play it most lives. Yeah, it's also a great song. It's one of my favorites as well. Big, big, big sound, and I don't think anybody else can sing it like Michael Bolton. Um, so Arthur's theme, yeah, we'll do Arthur's theme. Again, how's the audio, folks? Everyone, everything good? Not cracking? Not uh, distorting in any way? Ben Jones, hello. That's from Lee. Hello, Ben. It's it's amazing. I never know what I'm going to play on these uh, on these lives. And you know, somebody <laughs> made a little comment there on the chat. I think it's disappeared. But early this morning, it was like, put the set list on, and it might be a little bit more inviting. When I just had to explain that it's all about you guys, you know. So it's not. Um, I mean, I, I have a couple that I put in there, but I didn't know today that I was going to play. How c how am I supposed to live without you? And it's great, great, great song. I had a good feeling, though, that I would be playing Arthur's theme because <laughs> it does seem to be a favorite among everyone. But that's all right because it's one of my favorites, too. I do enjoy playing it. All right, let's have a look because it did freeze up a little bit here, so I don't know why, but uh, let's have a look. Let's have a look. Oh, what, what was that? Here we go. <laughs>
again, what a song. You asked for the <laughs> and thank you so much. Oh, man, that's lovely. It really is. Um, that stupid freaking wrong note in the middle of it, though, it's like, ah. It was near perfection, and apart from whatever it was that I hit there. My goodness. Still good with the audio? You still good with the audio? Hope so. I got a request for some Coldplay. Love it, love it, love it. I do love that song. 
All right, what we got here? I don't know what this is, this is going on here. I don't know what's happening, but uh, I just saw a a request for. Oh, I can. I just can't stop loving you, Michael Jackson. I probably won't do the key change on this because I can't. I probably will screw it up every time I do it. But um, I'm going to add the strings for this one because uh, I don't think you can do this without strings. There we go. Trying to remember how it starts. run, you have to do it right. I'm going to do it again. See? There we go. Let's try it again. I go have a go at the key change. Ah, see, <laughs> see, I've forgotten it all together. Because it does change key, it goes into a bridge and then it changes key. Ah. It goes to that somehow, and I can't remember it. I'm going to have to work on that. I hate the key it goes into anyway. I think it goes into D flat. Okay, 
let's uh, see what we've got here. I got a, a tip there from Dan the Man. <coughs> midnight train to change. Uh, midnight train to Georgia. I don't know it, Dan. But being as you've thrown five quid at me, I'm going to do. I just called to say I love you. It's not one of my favourites. Glad you guys are all having fun. No, it's okay, Dan. Absolutely. Um, I'll do it. If I can find it. I do have a file here somewhere for it. I think I do. Let's see how this goes. Are we locked up again? Yeah, please play on. I am. Yeah, I think we've locked up. I don't know what happens with this. Sometimes it happens where it's old. It's like me. So I switch it off, get the uh, old file back again. That's good. Of course you can do a request, yeah. That's where everyone else is. They're all putting requests in. But I'm uh, a little bit of silence right now while I find this song. Come on, come on, come on. I think I'm almost there. Oh, man, that was really, really loud. What happened to that? Right, let's take some of these down a little bit. If that didn't distort, I think it did. <laughs> Absolutely certain it did. This is one of those files i got to work on, I think. All right, where's the bass? just that would do for you down the man so did i hear some things in there which is going to be lewis has got a, a youtube channel is that what did i miss something or was that right 
Lewis, you're going to do a YouTube channel? You're starting to put some songs on? We're going to see what you actually look like? You've been on every live here since the 16th one, I think. Hello by Lionel Richie. I just did that one, and I just saw a <coughs> request as well for some Sting. I, did, I started out with um, Message in a Bottle. So you can come back and you can see the uh, <laughs> the replay tomorrow once this is uploaded again. I want to tell you what happened last week as well. Remember somebody asked for memories uh, by Maroon 5 and I couldn't remember how it went. So I got my iPad, I went into Google and I got my uh, I got on Google and I played the song. Well straight away I got a copyright claim on that um, for playing the actual song, the real song because I held it up to the screen like that and you know there he was singing away, and I got dinged for it. So I had a choice. I could, I I'd already lost the chat. The chat was, uh, was disabled on that video. So I, I'm not, I don't want to try and get those copyright issues because I hate it when the chat disappears because I like to be able to catch up when I'm putting the timestamps on. So it happens, unfortunately. It happens. Have you been here since Life One? Have you really, Lewis? Unbelievable. This is the 29th. Who's been here since the 16th then? I want somebody, one of you on here. Dan, you've been on since the beginning as well? Wow. Well, I got some bad news for you for next week. I'm not going to be here. Um, it's <laughs> I've actually got uh, a friend of mine who's doing a car show in, in, uh, in Wellington uh, called the Con Palm Beach Concours. And Derek Bell's going to be there. And I did say that I would help him. I didn't realize that it was a Sunday, but it is. It's this, uh, the fif 15th. And so I am so sorry, everyone. I'm not in the White House. That's going to be... I'm going to be in Mar-a-Lago, though, on the 2nd of December, possibly. But um, no, no, 7th. I don't know. Anyway, um, another car show, because I am a, a kind of car, car guy. I do a show my of my own, um, but COVID is... Scrapped it all for now. Um, <laughs> may have scrapped it for good. I don't even know yet. But uh, yeah, I'm going to be uh, not here next week. So I apologize. But I will make it up for you. And also, I may as well let you know now that uh, Vanessa and I are going to go on vacation in December. So two Sundays in December I'm going to miss. Because I can't take my piano with me. And we're taking the dogs. We're just going up to North Carolina for 10 days. We've got a cabin up there. It's going to be real cold. I wish I was coming to the UK. We were supposed to be going to the UK. And uh, I had to cancel my hotel in London. And I know that everything's locked down there again, which really sucks. Because we were so looking forward to going. So, yeah, we're going to go to North Carolina. Richard's been there from the beginning as well. Wow. Oh, music by John Miles. I don't do it, I'm afraid. <laughs> I've had Ferrari since three. <laughs> I had a red car since three. I think I was a bit older than that. I know, Mom, I know. We can't come. It really sucks. And you couldn't come here. You had to cancel your holiday in March. It really sucks. Let's do a little bit of Barry. All right, let's get rid of that piano. All right, this is really hard because I have to, I have to play the piano, but I'm having to watch the lights on here. <coughs> I just wanted to make sure that it didn't count me in.
wonderful, wonderful. Yeah, I'll be gone from the 10th to the 20th. So there's two Sundays in there. I think the 20th is a Sunday. What the heck was happening with this? Let's just roll on. I want less today without you with the keyboard. Who was that? Oh, Stephen, thank you. Let me just do this one. start again. I Am Your Child by Barry Manilow, that one was. Really, really lovely song. It's funny, there's a little keyboard on the right side of the stage as you're facing the stage watching him in concert, and he only uses that one little keyboard for that one song. Goes off stage right, um, his stage left, the right to where we're looking, and uh, just a single spotlight on him. Beautiful, beautiful song. All right, let's do... Um, I want less today without you with the keyboard for that two pound tip or two euros, whatever it was. Appreciate the tips, by the way. Uh, somebody's talking about my jeans. Look at this. This is, this is um, it's called fashion, right? Because I've got another one here, right? And, yeah. There's more. Oh, yep, yeah, there it is. There. They were actually bought, purchased, ripped. Because I thought I looked really cool with purposely ripped jeans. So wash your mouths out on that chat. You need to buy me new jeans. Actually, I do need some new jeans. American Eagle for you. How about that? All right. I won't last a day without you. Again, I'm going to be following the lights on this one. Ha, <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> All right. So I got the okay. Straight in. Two, three, four. <laughs> on I don't know what's going on with this it just keeps going off I don't know why this is the disclavia it's not recognizing the disclavia for some reason on the Wi-Fi it just keeps um, let me refresh the page and see what happens here because it should be on there all the time but okay I'm gonna follow the lights and see when the keyboard comes in Welcome, Stephen. Glad you enjoyed that song. It's a great song. I see Marina's here. Good to see you.
to put strings on. Yes, Stephen, the music is available for this now on Music Notes. So then we add strings to this. Again, this thing, I don't know what's going on with it. It's not a good advert, that's for sure. <laughs> Rainbow Connection, Kermit the Frog, and the Carpenters did that song as well. So it is on Music Notes. It is on Music Notes, Stephen. It's awesome. I like that song. It's getting low, getting low. Strangest quest? I don't know. There's, there's many strange requests, to be honest. But uh, I think the most um, requested song ever, and I really don't like it because of that fact. <laughs> Yeah, um, used to get asked for that a lot. As time goes by, playing again, Sam used to say. All right, sorry about this. I'm looking for that song that Lewis was asking for. I can't remember. I can't find the lyrics, Lewis. So I'm gonna just have to play it. Right, because I need the lyrics because I won't remember them. 
It's not far down to paradise Just you wait for me And if the wind is right You can sail away To find tranquility Oh, the canvas can do miracles Just to wait and see Believe me And it's not far to never, never amazes me that I can remember all of this music without sheet music and I can't for the life of me remember lyrics from songs and it made uh, you know I, I watch these artists on stage and there, there's no sh lyric sheets at all and they're just I listen I know that they do these songs every night and I used to do the same thing you know when I was in a piano bar I used to do the same thing I used to sing and sing and sing every I didn't need the lyrics but nowadays I just freaking need them and it just it bugs the heck out of me but you know, I'm in my living room. <laughs> You're not paying to listen to me. <laughs> Some of you are. <laughs> I, I'm just, um, it just amazes me that it does. It's funny, I went to see Elton John um, once at Manchester. Where was I? Um, Manchester Arena, somewhere. Got a last minute ticket. And I was behind him, I was behind the stage. And I was looking at Elton John playing the piano with, you know, 17,000 or so people in front of him. And what amazed me was he had auto cue for all of his songs. And I listen, uh, look at all the sign times he's played your song. And he has auto cue with all the lyrics coming up for all the songs. I couldn't believe it. But yeah, he, even Elton John has his little cheat sheet there. Clever, right? I don't know that one, Richard. All right, you can see me a little bit now. Ah, it's hot. I got the fan on here too. Yeah, no power outages here, Do Deb. Are you you're around the corner, right? Is your power on? We're talking about this stupid storm that we've got coming here. It's pretty rough out there. Might need another one. Hmm, hmm, hmm. 
Don't know it. Music by John Miles. It's never one that I've done, you know. I don't know all the songs that there are. Wish I did, but uh, yeah, I don't do that one. How's it go? Is this it? Oh. give it a go. You know, there's another one as well. Um, I think, yeah, that's one. I'll have to have a go. This one as well by um, Christopher Cross. I don't do it. I don't do it properly. Ah, oh, Toto did some great songs as well, and I don't know any of those. Uh, da, 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 da. So on and so on and so on. I gotta go get another beer. Can you come with me? Oh yeah, can you, Vanessa? Vanessa's saying, can can do you want me to get you on? <laughs> I think they all wanted to see the pub again. <laughs> all right, I think Vanessa's coming to get me one. Bear with me. Even the stupid lyric sheet book that I've got here, <laughs> it's, it's all out of order. It used to be in, it, all, it used to be in alphabetical order, <laughs> and now it's not, and I don't know why it isn't. I don't know what I did with it. It must have been one of these <laughs> stupid gigs where I needed to pull stuff out. Oh, my goodness. Having fun, everyone. <laughs> ah. It's ridiculous. Ridiculous. All right, so that's when on my week off, I'm going to take uh, this book. And I'm going to sort it out. Uh, there's a few, Lewis, maybe, I don't know. 50 or 60 songs, I don't know. But I don't know why they're not in order. But they're not. Oh, there's, I just found sailing. <laughs> 
just found sailing. That would have helped about 10 minutes ago. Oh, my goodness me. Ridiculous. You're all still there. <laughs> crazy, 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 crazy. What? <laughs> Vanessa's getting me a drink. She's going out in the hurricane. It's okay. Yeah, Vanessa sings. She won't sing. You can see me and, and you can see the piano. I think I made an error, an error with that one.
Thank you for that uh, suku. Yeah, enjoying that. Um, it's sounding great through my headphones, by the way. I know that you're saying it's, uh, imagine what it sounds like. It's sounding freaking great right through here. I'm right through the mixing desk. Everything's mic'd up. Hope you're enjoying it. Um, sounds pretty good here. Um. <laughs> <laughs> Let me have another drink. <laughs> you can see it's live, right? You're seeing me, you're seeing the piano. You're hearing the mistakes. It's funny, though. I've seen so many lives by professional artists who perform all the time, and they're not squeaky clean. <laughs> Awesome, right? Lovely, lovely song. I got a, t I got a tip here. Hang on a minute. All right, Will Towers. Thank you so much. A nightingale sang in Berkeley Square. You can't beat this one. You just can't beat it because it's a cracking song. It's an older one, but it's lovely and. Um, I do have the sheet music for this one as well. <coughs> um, just a little word of word of advice for guys that you know. I got an email from somebody 
uh, yesterday saying that they bought 12 pieces of music from Sheet Music in, in one go. 12 pieces of mine in one go. If that sounds like you, and it could be you, 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 you really don't need to do that. You need to support me on Patreon. <laughs> Patreon.com forward slash Neil Archer. I do have some little tiers. <coughs> you financially support me, and I give you back discount codes for music notes. $5 a month. That's all it is. $5 a month. You support me. It's a recurring payment, and every single month I give you a 25% off gift card. So instead of nine ninety nine for a sheet of music, it's going to cost you seven fifty. And there's no minimum purchase. You can get as many as you want, and you're going to save 25% on that checkout. So there are some larger tiers as well. You can have the MIDI files to all of my songs that are you know with the, with the sheet music. Um, a couple more tiers you can get on the phone with me. I can help you through some pieces and do a one on one thing. But if you're buying sheet music and you're buying more than two or three a month, you really need to support me because the money goes towards music for me to, you know, because I, I don't write the music. I make the arrangements, I put them onto YouTube, and then there's another company that uh, gets the sheet music and, uh, sorry, gets the video and, and writes the music exactly note for note how I play it. So, it's extremely expensive, so it's a way to give back to me. It's a way for me to give back to you, but don't be paying full price if you're going to be buying three or four sheets a month, all right? I'm always working on more, so thought I'd mention that. <laughs> www.patreon, which is P-A-T-R-E-O-N forward slash Neil Archer. Lee's on there, and Lee's been buying my music, and he's a Patreon supporter as well. Let me just go here and I'll write it down. You can visit the, the link and you can see if it works for you. Join me and I believe me, I, I'd, I'd love to give you some money off just for five bucks a month by supporting me. Let me put this here. All right, I just posted it there. Patreon.com forward slash Neil Archer. Give that link a click and take a look at it. Um, there are nine people supporting me right now, and I think we're bringing in about 149 bucks a month, something like that. Um, that at least gets me one sheet. It's really pricey to get these sheets transcribed. Um, somebody just asked me, I think it was, it was you, Lee. Um, you asked me about... Uh, begin the beginning. I just approved it this morning. It's beautiful, man. It's awesome. It's 10 pages long. I love it. I love it when they're that long, you know, because it's an intricate and, uh, you know, I was talking to one of my Patreon guys last week on the phone and he says that my s arrangements are full of notes. And I, I love that. I love that saying. Um, so, yeah. Give that link a click, patreon.com, and if it works for you, join me. Oh, thank you, Lee. <laughs> All right, this one's done well on music notes, I must tell you.
Yeah, that's Nightingale sang in Berkeley Square. A golden oldie, good old standard. Uh, I haven't, uh, Vuk, no, I haven't done uh, gold. I think I should work on it. Yeah, <laughs> my tall listing. <laughs> I like it. Uh. So let's uh, check in with uh, how we're doing on this live. How many people? Oh, Ant. I th thank you so much. Ant, you became a Patreon member. Thank you so much. You don't even play. <laughs> Unbelievable. Well, Leighton, I appreciate the support. It's a recurring payment, and listen, it does help me. It helps me put these songs together, and just as, w as well as all the tips on here as well. It really does. I r I'm reinvesting all the time. And it's funny because, you know, a lot of people are asking me to do streaming music, and, and I've got one song on iTunes, um, Spotify, Pandora, you know, Amazon Music one song because i thought i would play around with it you know the whole thing about when i when i do on youtube right i just play no big deal i just play a song and copyright's not a, a big deal with youtube you know everyone seems to think that it is but it isn't so if you play piano just start uploading you know you get emails something there's some information about this video don't worry about it just keep uploading just keep putting songs on there you know yes they are copyrighted pieces. Every one that I've played today, I didn't write. Somebody else did, so they want a piece of the pie, right? When it comes to streaming, though, it, they do need paying, and I need to have copyright released. Same with the sheet music, right? When somebody, uh, when I put the sheet music together, and I give it to Music Notes, Music Notes does all the legal stuff. They make sure that it's all kosher, and the artists have been paid. Um, yeah, so... I, I really am trying to do the sheet music before I do the streaming, but I know I wish I could do it all, <laughs> but I can't. So the streaming songs will be coming because uh, I know that it's like the sheet music was really, really, it, took, it was slow to take off, right? But the more sheets that I've got on there, the more people are buying it and more people are coming. And they're not only coming to sh from my channel to, my to the sheet music, they're coming from the sheet music to my channel. So I got to do things in priorities. Oh, I know, Lee. <laughs> I, I I appreciate that, but no, it's it's it, the copyright's a big thing, man, and I I don't want to get dinged for uh, for anything. I don't want to do anything wrong. I want to do it all legal. And yes, it would be easy. I mean, even these MIDI files, you know, I I can't even give them away until I get them copyright released. So it's a it's a challenge, but uh, you know, it's not so bad if you've got a couple of hundred people looking at you know, about twenty five thousand subscribers and and growing. <laughs> Yeah, it's you got to do it right, and so it, it is. It's all above board. But um, the one song is a Whitney Houston. Uh, uh, um, which one is it? Which one is it? Take a look, Neil Archer. I'm on iTunes, but wha one song only. <laughs> one song only. But I'll get there. Didn't we almost have it? Oh, that's the one. Yeah. Whitney Houston song. It's the only one on iTunes, but there'll be more later. But uh, man, I'm just watching the wind here, just blowing up everything. It's madness. Yeah, but let's have a look how many people are on here right now. We've got <coughs> all right, 37 people on right this minute, which is not a lot, I know. But people come in and out. They go in and out. Um, Usually when I've finished on this live, you know, there's always about four, four or five hundred people that have at least swung into the piano bar, right? Because that's what it is. I don't expect people to come in and, you know, stay forever. And, uh, you know, so it is in and out, in and out. You know, stop and have a drink and listen to some music and then leave. Usually, uh, usually about 10 or 15 minutes that people hang around for and then they leave. But the diehards, they're here from the beginning to the end. The whole thing. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you did see 47 earlier. Yeah, because it's just I'm, I'm wanging on here right now. Oh, superstar. Look at that, Lee. Another £1.99. Okay, how much is in the tip jar? Let's have a look. $23 in the tip jar. <laughs> 23 I think that's um, about tw uh, tw 12, 11 bucks an hour. Something like that. 11 bucks an hour. I don't know if you've noticed, but when I'm putting. Um, 
the timestamps on the video is when I can edit them. Once this once this live video uploads to YouTube, it now becomes a, a video, and all the chat stays there and everything. I'm shouting out every person that gives me some money. So thank you guys for giving me money, and you can see how big that they come up. So. Carpenters, superstar, here we go. All right, because I do, I do as many qu requests as I can, but um, it's like in a piano bar, right? Somebody throws me some dollars into the tip jar. Hey, I'm going to play your song, you know? <laughs> it's always a little bit dangerous doing that. Because <laughs> if I don't know it, I have to do something else, but uh, I can usually get around, you know, at least one song from the band that you've... Uh, Asked for. Okay, would you like it with the keyboard or would you like it just solo piano? I can do it either way, whichever way you prefer. <coughs> It'll take me a while to find it on the keyboard. I can just do solo piano. Well, you know, I've done it with the keyboard for the last few weeks, so <laughs> let's do it. Yeah, let's, do, let's just do it on solo piano today. Adrian, thank you so much. I like those comments. Um, 
So, yeah. <laughs> Little different, right? On solo piano. Uh, James Bond, I don't know, I don't do any James Bond themes, Lee, at all. Um, maybe I need to ta start learning some, but uh, I don't. Uh, somebody just asked for a Michael Jackson song, I can't, just can't stop loving you. I already did it, so watch the replay. All right, this is from my mom, she just asked for this. Move the, move, move the mic out of the way. We're coming to an end. Got to end sometime, right? Songs for you all together now, and you can tell everybody. And 
you can tell everybody that this is a song. Maybe quite simple, but now that it's done, hope you don't mind. Hope you don't mind. Hope you don't mind. Glad I put that in words. How wonderful life is when you're in. Kicked off the moss. Well, a few of the verses, well, they've got me quite cross. Son, it's been quite kind. One well, wrote this song. It's for people like you that keeps it turned on. So, excuse me for getting. Sing. I'm really losing the words here. Anyway, the thing is, I want to really be. But yours are the sweetest eyes I've ever seen. All together, you can tell everybody. And you can tell everybody this is your song. It's simple, but now that it's done, hope you don't mind. How wonderful life is on your grim world. I hope you don't mind, hope you don't mind. You're in the world. I haven't seen uh, I haven't seen Lorado today. Is Lorado on here? I haven't seen him. He's usually on. Not seen him either. <coughs> yep, Karen's not here either. So guess what, folks? I went into the music store the other day, and because um, I was looking for something for a friend of mine who's got a restaurant here in locally in Tequesta, Florida, and um, I found a piano. It was really nice. It was a Baldwin. It was an upright, and um, it played really nice. And uh, I said, I think you should buy it, you know, because I think it's been nicely tuned. It's been well looked after, which is the most important thing when you're buying an acoustic piano. Played lovely, nice and bright. So it's being delivered on Tuesday. Uh, anyway, to cut a long story short, I was talking to the guy, and I'm like, listen, Stephen, when are we going to do a live in the store? So it's possibly the weekend before Thanksgiving. So it may not be, it won't be next week because I'm going to miss it because I'm going to an event, and I apologize profusely, but I've only missed like three in the, since I started this in April. Um, so the, the following week, it might be from the store. But... Uh, I was asking him, I said, how's business? This is Piano Distributors of Florida, by the way. And if you don't know the story, this beautiful Yamaha GB1K Grand is theirs. They brought it to my house and allowed me to use it for my YouTube channel. It's a $26,000 piano. You can get it for about $22,000 thereabouts. And uh, so I asked him how his business was, and he says, it's busy. I'm like, how are the, how are the disclavies going? He's like, they're going crazy. And I'm like... Okay, he saw. He said we sold three today. This was on Friday. They sold three twenty-six thousand dollar pianos on Friday. One day, I can believe it. I'm like, uh, okay. He says the problem is now inventory. 
I'm like, oh, man, here we go. So I said to him, I said, don't come looking for mine. And he's like, <laughs> the question was asked. I'm like, oh, my goodness, really? The question was asked. So I don't know what's going to happen to this. Listen, at the end of the day, it's their piano, right? It's not mine. They took mine and they sold it. <laughs> so <laughs> this is their piano. So listen, if they do take it away, it'll be temporarily. But it is because of COVID. They can't get inventory of these pianos. And listen, if they're selling them, they're selling them. Um, those of you that have not seen this piece of, piece, piece of kit, it's absolutely unbelievable. Um, I'm going to just play this real quick. Because you have to see this. Not only is it, you know, it's got the strings, it's got the electric piano, you can overlay sounds together, but it's got amazing sounds um, and songs built into the piano. And if you don't believe me, and it plays itself, I can record myself playing, I can play it back. Um, I wouldn't have known about the technology on these pianos if I hadn't have walked into the music store on Indian Town Road in Jupiter, piano distributors of Florida. And we just got chatting, you know, about my... YouTube channel, and yeah, it was just amazing how the conversation ended up. Of you know, how can we help work with you? And so that's why you see on all of my videos, piano distributors dot com is they sponsor me by bringing me this fantastic brand new instrument. And it's funny, you know, I look back on some of my videos that at the time I was really proud of, and then I listen to them now and I'm thinking, my goodness, that GA1 grand that I paid 7,000 for, which I thought was a lovely piano, was so out of tune. And, and uh, you know, I'd read online that, that this GA1 was notoriously bad for, yeah, for going out of tune. Um, but this is just a beautiful instrument. And listen, guys, if you have the money to invest in something like this, it will take your play into the next level. I'm not kidding you, just to have something, it's like, you know, taking, I, I mean, comparing cars, right? You take, a, you take a, 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 a Ford Focus, right? And then you drive an Aston Martin Vanquish, right? The difference is unbelievable. It's just the, the better, you want to drive the thing more because it's worth driving. And it's the same with this. I know, it is, it's, it's more the space than money. I know the thing is as well, they do the upright version of the Disclavia, um, but it's not any cheaper. That's the problem. It's about the same price, 25 grand. Uh, I think in the UK, um, it's about 14, 15,000 pounds. It's a lot of money because it has the same technology, I suppose, you know. But listen to this. If you haven't seen this before, um, and I'm going to do one more song, and then I'm going to get out of here. But watch this. This is cricking. This is cool. <laughs> Yesterday morning, they let me know you were gone. Suzanne, the plans they made put an end to you. I walk out this morning and I wrote down this song. So cool. Isn't it amazing? I love this thing. Won't you look down upon me, Jesus? You've got to help me make a stand. Right, let's do one more, one more. Look at this. Wait till you hear the vocals.
just took the voices off, it's just the piano now. All right? Just from the app. Just from the app. I can bring them in again. Look. Slide in. Here we go. From the dark Right, so I wanted to show you that because it just takes the technology to a whole new level. It really does. I was blown away by it. And not only am I blown away by the songs that are built into the piano, because when you get the piano, you get the Disclavia by app, and then you can pull up all the songs on. There's 500 built-in songs in the piano. It's all done via Wi-Fi. And um, <coughs> the most amazing thing I think that I've ever seen in, in, in any uh, musical instrument is the Disclavia radio. Now, I'm not going to play it because I'll get copyrighted on it because it's all original songs, <coughs> but it's you just pick a genre. I think it's like 14 bucks a month, something like that. Pick a genre, sign in, and boom, away you go. And it's Buble, and it's Sinatra, and it's, you know, every, anyone you can think of. All original artists, Lady Gaga was on there, you know. It's even adult contemporary. It's all the latest stuff. And the piano notes play. And the rest of it comes through the speakers in the piano. You can take lines out and put it through your hi-fi system or your sound system. It's really, really, really cool. So anyway, I hope you've enjoyed the, the session. It's uh, coming up on two hours, and so I'm going to get out of here. Um, listen, the tip jar, the virtual tip jar is on the piano, and I'm going to leave it to you guys. We're going to do Piano Man, all right, because there is a little song, a little, little part in, in the song where it says, they said at the bar they put bread in my jar. All right, so <coughs> we're not in the piano bar, but you can pretend we are, right? It's going to be the virtual tip jar, and there's a little dollar sign out there. Just throw the dollars at me. I promise you I will put it to sheet music and do something with it. This is not for me to get rich. It's just for you to say thank you for the live stream. We've had a lot of fun. And I'll give you a shout-out when I put the uh, lyrics on there as well, on the, uh, the, the, the time stamps as well, on um, when I do the uh, updated video. <laughs> Testing your speakers, that's all. All right, sing a long time. Sing a long time. It's gone nine o'clock. On a Sunday, and the YouTube crowd shuffled in. There's an old man sitting next to me, making love to his tonic and gin. He says, Son, can you play me a memory? But I'm not really sure how it goes. But it's sad and it's sweet, and I knew it complete. I used to wear women's clothes all together now. Here we go. La, lily, la, lily, la. Lily, la, lily, la. Lily, la. Sing us a song, you're the piano man. Sing us a song tonight. Cause we're all in the mood for a melody. And you've got us feeling alright. Just as it keeps falling down. And now John at the bar, he's a friend of mine, and he gets my bit drinks for free. And he's quick with a joke or to light up his smoke, but there's some place that he'd rather be. He says, Neil, I believe this is killing me. There's a smile run away from his face But he's quick with a joke Got to light up his smoke If I could get out of this place Here we go La, lily, la, lily, la Lily, la, lily, la Lily, la Sing us a song, you're the piano
I know I'm Sing us a song tonight Cause we're all in the mood for a melody And you've got us feeling alright Gives me a smile Cause he knows it's me You've been coming to see To forget about lockdown For a while And the piano it sounds Like a carnival And the microphone it smells Like a Stella And they stare at their screens They put dollars in on a super chat. That's what this is called, you see. That's what this is called. Super chat, when you put dollars on the chat. They stare at the screens and they put dollars on the super chat. And they say, man, what are you doing here? Lily la, lily la. Lily la, lily la. Sing us a song tonight Cause we're all in the mood for a melody And you've got us feeling alright go there you go there you go hope you enjoyed that I know I did so those of you from America I did say to you that hey next week we may have a new president I'll say it again tonight <laughs> who knows right what's happening with this thing we have a president that uh, celebrated last night and uh, spoke to the nation and then we have another president uh, well he president I like that was another president that uh, hasn't said a word I'm not even tweeting. <laughs> so, watch this space. Well, lots of craziness going on in the U.S. So, I hope you've enjoyed it, everyone. And I'll see you on Wednesday. I might do Coldplay on Wednesday, because I think I know enough songs to be able to do a, a night of uh, Coldplay. <laughs> Karen, thank you. Noah, <laughs> my mom's on there. Auntie Mavis is on there. We've got Lee on there, Lewis from the very beginning. We've got Dan on as well from the very beginning. I'm not talking about the very beginning of tonight. I'm talking about the very beginning. We're on to number 28 right now. And they've been on since the very beginning, <laughs> number one. <laughs> so join me again on Wednesday. I won't be here next week. I do apologize. And thank you, Vuk. Thank you. Hope I've made it fun for you. Thank you for bringing, coming along for the ride and being an audience. And it really feels like... It, it's like funny, you know, on a, on, a, on a Sunday and I'm getting ready to do this. I'm looking at my watch and thinking, yeah, I'm going to be live in a few, a couple of hours, you know. It actually does feel like a gig. It feels like I'm coming in to entertain you. Um, but it's fun. I like it. It's, it, 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 it challenges me. <coughs> There's no hiding duff notes, wrong notes, just like a piano bar. Differences between 
YouTube Live and a piano bar <laughs> is that uh, it stays on YouTube forever. So usually when you make a duff note, you know, and somebody's on a cruise ship, they're gone back home, you know, in a week. They don't remember that duff note. But people that are watching these lives for the same for the first time are thinking, what the heck is that? But hey, listen, if 99% of the notes are, the, are right, 1% are, are wrong, I can deal with that. All right? <laughs> okay. It's, gonna, it's blowing a real gale. I tell you what, I'm going to you t- take you out there. I'll show you what's going on here. All right, you're just the audio with the phone now. I'm going to take my beer with me. Uh, I'll tell you what, let me get up here and then I'll show you a little bit of, uh, for those of you that are interested in my workstation. Mm. Pardon me. But it tastes good. Uh, for those of you that are looking at the space that I'm working with here, so this is my Yamaha GA1 Grand, which is absolutely beautiful. Um, black polyester finish. Uh, it's brand new. I got it in March. Like I said, it's not mine. It's from Piano Distributors. And then I, this is the space that I have here. Just all of this. I really cram it into the, the, the corner of the room, right? But it really gives me, it's tight, but it's but it's okay. So I have my microphone here, I have the keyboard here, you know, the piano. This is my mixer right here. You know, my lyric sheet that I've got to sort out. And then right there, if I can zoom in, that's my comments look. So the comments there is what I'm viewing to be able to keep an eye on what you guys are saying the iPad, and of course my, my drink mat. So it's a, it's a tight little spot, but it's kind of comfortable, you know? It's like when you get into a car, um, you know where everything is. <clears throat> yep, but that's it. So let's take a look outside and see what's going on. Cause, uh... Yep, it's raining and it's blowing. Look at this. I wasn't kidding. This is our front. We got two Ford Escapes there. That's our. <coughs> one's a 2009, one's a 2020. But uh, it's, yeah, it's, um, yeah, no Ferrari. No Ferrari, I'm afraid. But look at it. It's blowing up a right storm. This is supposed to be 60 mile an hour winds tomorrow. And, uh, I may have to go and show a house, which uh, I really didn't want to do. Not in this, but uh, hey, that's my main job because I sell real estate. I'll take you through here. This is a great thing about uh, living in Florida and living in a piece of land where there's a lot of trees, because this is what my pool ends up looking like. Look at this leaves everywhere but yeah it's blowing a lot look look <laughs> crazy anyway that's it folks floating a piano <laughs> All right, I will see you on Wednesday. And for those of you that can't make Wednesday, you can watch the replay and then uh, I'll be back here in two weeks. Hopefully it'll be from the piano store. Okay? All right, everyone. All the best. Have a great week, great couple of weeks. And uh, hopefully you'll see some uploads in the next few days. Cheers. Enjoy the rest of your night. Bye.